been a pleasure for us to be here again. Uh, I would say that uh, also this year uh, Innovation Africa has been a great opportunity for us uh, to meet uh, the leaders that are shaping the agenda of the education system in, uh, in African countries. We uh, are as IBM very much committed to helping Africa uh, by developing the skills and the infrastructure uh, that will support uh, the long-term economic development uh, of the countries and create an innovation ecosystem, but at the same time we realize that in the long term we will not be successful if we cannot have access to a pool of talent and people with the skills that are needed for the knowledge economy. And uh, therefore the importance uh, to meet, uh, to collaborate, to partner with the academia, with the government and work together for the rise of Africa. And I would say that Innovation Africa 2016 has been once again a great opportunity, a great forum uh, to meet the African leader, to resonate around, around these teams and work together uh, for the future of Africa. Uh, it's been great. Uh, we have had some uh, very good interactions with our potential uh, partners, stakeholders and some of the governments. Uh, the biggest takeaway for us is that we were able to put forward what we do as Extra Marks and how Extra Marks can help bring better education to this part of the world. And especially we could showcase uh, some of the successful experiments and some of the successful implementations we have done in the remote areas of South Africa and our partnership with Telcom South Africa to take the best of the learning solutions to the homes of the learner. So from that perspective, it's been, a, it's been a good event. And rest I'll tell you after a week once I've started seeing some results of it. So. <laughs> great. It's great to be here again after a series of participations earlier. So it provides a brilliant platform for us to engage with all these different delegations in this huge continent around transformation, but particularly around capacity building. And with this combination where we play a key role in, on, on the continent, we basically can benefit the delegations, the countries, as well as us. I'm in a learning space here because it's my first time to attend this, um, this meeting. And so if we know what is happening um, in the education space on the continent, then we can look at where are there possible ways that um, the foundation can align itself with some of the organizations that are here or get to learn from them or scale up some of our programming um, with the partners that we're with just from, under, from a better understanding, even from a policy point of view. because. What the ministers have talked about, at least from this first opening day sessions, about access, quality, those are the sort of areas that we want to be able to play a part in, especially the access and making sure that it's access to quality education. Here again, this is I think our fifth one. Uh, this is my third. Uh, I think we've been here since the beginning and it's been I think my best one so far. Part of it's Nairobi. Nairobi is such a vibrant city and I think just like the energy here this year I think was, was just phenomenal. After so many years of coming here, we listened to the market, we came up with a solution for Kenya, for Africa, and we really, this is the first time we launched it and rolled it out, and we're getting a tremendous amount of feedback, really, really positive feedback. So now we've got to just get it into the market and, uh, and do some of the things that we talked about this week. We are pleased to have, you know, to, to, to be in part of the Innovation Africa. This is already the second time for us. And we just, as discussed with Abdul, we would like to really con continue because we really see big potential here and uh, the uh, quality of contacts we get here, I think it's, you know, it's exactly what we, we were looking for. Very excited, a bit tired because of last night we had a nice event from you guys, and uh, but uh, overall good quality, good meetings and uh, we would like to be present in the next, next event. So thank you again. Thanks a lot. That's us. High speed Wi-Fi. Everyone loved it. Everyone thought Innovation Africa was great because they experienced the Wi-Fi. See and taste, that's what we say. So um, we can solve the connectivity problems of Africa at high speed. It works because of the ruckus dog. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. The meetings have been great. Um, we've had uh, a number of interactions where we see that connectivity is a serious challenge in Africa and we're coming with some solutions that are really attractive to the different governments. So we've got a number of interactions now lined up following the conference. It's just been lovely to be in Kenya. The weather's been great. It was a lovely venue, hospital people, um, very friendly, and thank you to Kenya for hosting us. <laughs>